Okay. Let's get started on our first um, special edition collector booster. Um, we have two of these. And it's kind of disappointing, but these collector booster boxes don't come with a. Um, what's it called? Um. Oh geez, I'm I'm at a loss for words, but oh, a box topper. Okay, let's make sure we've got all of them in here. Six oh. and six. Okay, let's get to it. Our first pack with these special edition edition collector boosters. I don't really remember how much. Um, the cards are worth like off the top of my head in comparison to the main set collector booster boxes the cards that come in that so we might do some looking into that quite a bit but it'll be alright okay. for a common Easterling Vanguard Gimli's Fury our uncommon mirror of Galadriel, gift of strands, our silver foil common Dunlin Crevain, Gimli's Fury, Aemer of the Rittermark for our uncommon, the Bath Song, our surge foil land, and from the commander set, um, Gilrain Dunedain Protector in a rare. I'll set these over here. Um, Doors of Durin. Rare. Eagle of Deliverance. Okay, cool. I needed this um, borderless one, so I'm happy with that. Lobelia Sackville Baggins in a rare surge foil. Samwise the Stout Hearted Uncommon Surge Foil. And Aragorn, the Uniter Mythic. Um, I believe the ones that are serialized will be foil, if I'm not mistaken. Um, but we don't have this poster art yet, so very happy with that. And then our food token, treasure token, search foil. I really like the way the search foil tokens turned out. I wish that they did the emblem. Um, the one ring, or rather the, the ring, and the ring tempts you. Um, I wish they did that in search foil. I'm used to the jump starts that I just opened yesterday, uh, so I need to stop opening from the top like that. Don't wanna nick any good cards. Okay, for our commons, let's kind of get these scooted around a bit. Okay, Soothing of Smeagol, Improvised Club, Uncommon, Saruman the White, Ranger's Firebrand, Escape from Orthanc, Thillian Kingfisher, Stu the Conies, Erkenbrand, Lord of the Westfold, well, Lord of Westfold, Swamp, Surge Foil, very nice. For our um, commander, Kyrdian the Shipwright, don't think I have that one yet, so that's go that's, that's always good. Corsairs of Umbar, another um, commander card, a rare. Whoa. We've got the scene card in rare, Alorian Searing Light. Moria Marauder, Surge Foil, ooh, Surge Foil Bag End, let's see how much this is worth, I feel like it's worth a decent amount, but 
I feel that way about a lot of serge foils. It's kind of hard to read it. $3.96. Okay, yeah. $6.75. Not worth as much as I thought, but it's a mythic and it's also a box topper. So. And then our Hildebrandt art is Myriad Landscape, and this one is going to be in the silver foil. I'll put these over here, the Hildebrandt arts. Um, food, treasure. Okay, next pack. Jeez, these are a lot harder to open than Jumpstart. There we go. They open so aggressively. I wish they opened more like Jumpstart so that if there are serialized cards in here, you're not running the risk of chipping away at them. Okay, Erwin's Gift. The silver foil is so slick. It just causes all the non-silver foils to jump, jump to the side. Gandalf, Friend of the Shire fiery inscription. This art is really cool. I'm not sure I like it so much in the, the scroll case, the scroll showcase, but it's still, still pretty cool. Nemrudo Watcher. Mirror Mirror Guardian. What is it? Hey! Gollum, Patient Plotter. Aiden, King of Rohan. Our forest. Galadriel of La Florian. Pippin, Warden of Isengard. Felby's Shriek. Doors of Durin. Galadriel, Light of Valinor. And Tent with Discovery food and tentacle. I like the way the tentacle looks in the surge foil. Pretty awesome. Okay. Next one. Okay, that's that's much much safer, but it still didn't tear in the way I wanted it to there. My goodness. There we go. at the Hornberg, Second Breakfast, Eowyn, Lady of Rohan, Bilbo, Retired Burglar, A Smart Cavalier, Shelob's Ambush, oh, that's a common, my mistake, no, Foray of Orcs, Bilbo, Retired Burglar, Iron Mountain, Flowering of the White Tree. Nice. This was hard for me to um, pull from the main set, so it's nice to get it early on. Boromir, Warden of the Tower. Call forth the Tempest. Lotho, Corrupt Sheriff in Surge Foil. Uncommon, Mariadoc Brandybuck. Wow, nice. Anduril, Fly Flame of the West. Um, this is our second poster art we've hit that I don't have already. Um, and another mythic, so like, that's, that's quite impressive. Okay. The food with a person wrapped up in spider webs, probably by Sheila. Nice. Okay, I'm I'm super happy already with this collector booster box um, giving us a lot of poster cards, especially ones we don't have already. So can never complain there. Okay. Generous end. I don't know in terms of the show, the scroll showcase, but. I'm pretty sure this is worth something, at least in um, the normal set. 
before the special edition set was released. East Riding Farmer, Luke Luck of the White Hand, Gollum Patient Plotter, Easterling Vanguard, Gloria Scale, Eowyn Lady of Rohan, Glorfindel Dauntless Rescuer, Swamp, Ooh, a mythic Frodo Adventurous Hobbit from the Commander set. Mithril Coat, nice. Okay, and that's in the silver foil for our, oh geez, for our rare. Ooh, looks like Elven Chorus, yeah. <laughs> nice. Uh, Ramus Ecker, Elven Chorus and Surge Foil, that's nice. Gollum. Oh my goodness, no way. Mythic, the one ring in silver foil. This is worth something. How much, how much, how much is it worth now? Oh my goodness. See, the silver foil doesn't even want to read, but wow. Sorry, I'm just gazing at that. 748. Wow, 170. That's worth more than the soul ring that I have um, unserialized uh, for mortal men doomed to die. Yeah, we need to put this in a in a sleeve, um, which I have tucked away in here. So, one moment, please. <laughs> Holy cow, that that. I'm, I'm just lost for words, really. Our third mythic poster art, and it's the one ring in silver foil. Holy cow. What a beauty. Wow. And it's kind of confusing because when it's serialized, I think it's quite obvious, like, where it's, where it will be located, but... At the same time, I'm like searching. I'm like, is this is this a serialized one? But I mean, while we're at it, let's go ahead and put these two in um, in sleeves as well, since we don't have them yet. Wow, the one ring! Wow. I just did not expect to get that at all. Um, I was already quite content with what we have pulled so far. Um, so that was, that's unreal. That's all I have to say. Look at all this poster art. Okay, holy cow. I don't even care about the token. But let's keep going. Oh my goodness, 170. That's, that's insane. That's like half the price of the box. Okay. Like, do we even need to open anymore? I mean, what, what could we get that's better than that other than a serialized? I mean... We do need a few of the Hildebrand arts. Well, quite a few of the Hildebrand arts because the ones I keep hitting are all the same ones. Um, we don't have the one from, from the box art. So let's hope for that next. Like, let's keep our expectations low after the one ring. Wow. Okay, Ince Fury. Claim the Precious, Quick Beam Upstart Int, Bitter Downfall, Woe's Pathfinder, Lumpus Bread, The Mouth of Sauron, Bill the Pony, Plains, Mirkwood Elk. It always throws me off seeing the art from um, the Commander set because while I have the Commander decks, um, the cards that are within the main set, um, from Commander don't always have that art. Oh, let's put this back. Okay. Wow, I'm still... <laughs> what? Okay, Storm of Saruman is super hard to pull for me. Not only that, but it's a mythic. Not only that, but it's a, 
it's a silver foil it's it was hard for me to pull in the main set let's let's see what it's worth in this one uh, it's not really oh wait it's silver foil though 249 not much but still it's it's a mythic and one that i rarely pull legolas is quick reflexes this is i think the highest rated um borderless from uh the special edition releases yeah 1598 wow this this box is insane file of galadriel and surge foil the surge foils confuse me a lot because i don't know which ones are worth something which ones aren't Isengard released, Unleashed rather, my bad, Elvish Harbinger. I don't think I had her in non-foil, so not bad. Still not the ones we want, but uh, the spirit token's always cool. One you don't see as often. <sighs> I'm still catching my breath from that one ring, like, took my breath away, like, <laughs> did not expect that at all. Jeez, this pack doesn't want to open. What are you hiding? Yeah, after that one ring, I'm like keeping my mind about me to be extra careful here. <laughs> Don't just like bust into it. Okay. Oh my goodness. This is a crazy, crazy box. Okay. Willow Wind. Lash of the Balrog. If I'm putting any cards in the wrong place, just just ignore that. Lash of the Balrog, Shire Sheriff, Tale of Tenuvial, Knights of Dol Amroth. I really like this art. Any of the soldier artworks are really cool. Troll of Khazad Doom. Um, I'm curious if it's still worth anything um, with some of the prices shifting around. Probably is. Um, Rise of the Witch King, Fear Fire Foes. I wonder if we're going to get any Nazgul. I have at least one of each from the main set before they released this second half of the, half of the set. Well, I'm always giving peeks into what's below. Relic of Sauron. A symbol of the Entmoot. Yeah, I was like, okay, this must be one that's worth something because I don't remember the card but it's because it's commander jeez arboreal alliance gloin dwarf emissary what another mythic I don't think this one's worth a lot um but it is a box topper so that's pretty cool um I think this is Theoden's sword sword of Rohan it's interesting, the artwork on the sword, how it's different from the movies, um, but it's still pretty epic. And come on, come on. Tempt with Discovery. Non-foil for our Hildebrand art. These cards are slippery today. Whew! Not bad of a pack, but not what we've seen so far. Um, we did get that box topper, though. So, no complaints. And we've got smog for our token, looks like. We'll save him for last. Generous Ent, East Farthing Farmer, Aemer of the Rittermark. Bill the Pony, Brandywine Farmer, Pelagir Survivor, Stone of Eric, Eric, I don't know how to say that, Gollum's Bite, Swamp. I'm not too familiar with Magic the Gathering, um, as this is the first set I've ever actually, like, bought, because I'm a huge Lord of the Rings fan, clearly. Um... But I feel like anytime I've scanned any of the cards, I find that swamps are worth 
the most, and islands. Comment below if you know why that is. Are those colors better to play with? Curious about that. Okay, arrester of the council. Raise the palisade. Okay, and this is in silver foil. This, um, from what I recall, is a decently priced card. I think it's in the main set, if I'm not mistaken. Oh yeah, twelve seventy five. This this box just keeps on giving. This is crazy. Ooh, War Rider. I needed this as well. Um, after the jump starts, I got it in you know, the, the regular type of card without the, rather the border, the bordered card, not the borderless. So that's what I needed. What? Oh my God. Surge foil, the one ring borderless. How much is this worth? Oh my goodness. And it, this, the surge is just like, nah, I don't want you to scan me. Sorry guys. Okay. What is this? $7.91? $84. What? All these rings. This is absolutely insane. Um <laughs> maybe I should maybe I should take here. I was not prepared for all of this. Um I thought this was just gonna be like any other collector booster box I've opened from the special the special edition which is pretty, um, <laughs> uneventful, to say the least, so, holy moly, what in the world? Okay, we're just gonna set these to the side, and put this in a sleeve where it belongs, wow. Like, my hands are almost shaking, I'm, like, scared I'm gonna nick it on the edge, Wow. Let's let's just take a moment, guys. Let's just take a moment. Both in foil, one in surge foil, <sighs> borderless, and poster card. How insane. Oh, wow, am I glad I'm videoing? Well, let me check that I'm videoing. Like Okay, good, good. How terrible would that be? Like, trying to make my first video here and... Wow. Okay. Let's get back to it. Um... <sighs> wow. I am, like, completely at a loss for words here. Okay. Gimli, Mournful Avenger. Soul's Attendant. I don't think I have this in the silver foil so that's nice i'm not a big fan of the silver foil i'll admit i don't like how you can't really tell it's foiled especially when you have the cards in a sleeve it's very difficult to tell um i have to look at the bottom to see if it has the little star next to the set uh lettering okay <laughs> and there's smell almost forgot about him with all the craziness in that pack. We have four packs left. Like like I said, can it get any crazier? We, we've pulled two rings from this box and this is just outrageous. Like I said, I want I want this uh I want this box art and a card. I'm not complaining about the one ring. I definitely didn't have either of those cards yet in my collection, but <laughs> what could happen next? Like I said, holy moly. This is outrageous. I can't believe this is worth more than a soul ring. <sighs> I'll have to pop that out for our next video, show y'all what that looks like. Um, which one I got, that is. Okay. Eastmark Cavalier, Snarling Warg, Bill Fernie Bree Swindler, or a bag of Menace Morgul. Again, I, I still wonder if we're gonna get any Nazgul. If we get any Nazgul, I, I'd say this is the pack for it. Banish from Edoras, Breaking of the Fellowship. 
Gimli, Counter of Kills. Oh. Yeah, that's right. And Nazgul. Nope. Tale of Tenuvial. Planes. That's okay. Hithlane Rope. See, the scroll showcase is the... Am I saying that right? Yeah, scroll showcase. It's very hard to see the cards, some of them, which is kind of disappointing. Baragond. Baragond of the Guard. Anduril, Narsil the Forged. Fall of Carrot Andros. Elrond, Lord of Rivendell. I think I've seen that if you get the um, ring showcase, there's usually a good card. I think a Hildebrandt or a poster card behind it. So let's see. Yeah, Hildebrandt. River Kelpie. I don't think I have this one yet. So I'm not I'm not opposed to this. And it's Gollum. So it's pretty cool. Another food token. Another spirit token. Oh, three left. Wow, this is so impressive. It just makes me wonder what's going to be in my next box that I have lined up to video. I'm so glad I finally got some one rings that I don't have. I have a lot of the bordered um, from the main set before the special edition. Uh, set added on to the set. Wow, all sets. Okay. Protector of Gondor. Chance Met Elves. Strider, Ranger of the North. Gimli, Counter of Kills. I love the way this looks in the scroll showcase. Super epic. I like the way it looks in non-scroll showcase as well, but super epic. Morgul, Knife Wound. Improvised Club, Landerval Horizon Witness, Gandalf, Gandalf's Sanction, Forest, Shagrat, Loot Bearer. For some reason, this guy is really hard for me to pull, um, not in the scroll showcase in the main set. Banquet Guests, Nazgul Battle Mace, Isildur's Fateful Strike, Frodo Baggins, River Kelpie again, but this time in silver, uh, the silver foil tra treatment. Okay, food, ballistic boulder. Yeah, this this box is pretty. This box is pretty ballistic. I feel in a good way, in the best way. Okay, I'm curious if we're going to get any more poster art because we've gotten quite quite a few of those in this box. More than I expected, at least. I expected like two, maybe? And we've gotten, what, three? Well, I made it sound like a lot more, but... Arwen's Gift. Shower of Arrows. Marriottic Brandy Book. Butterbur, Bree Innkeeper, Esquire of the King, Haunt of the Dead Marshes, Oath of the Great Host, Gift of Strands, Island, Born Upon a Wind, Galadriel of Lothlorien, Riders of the Mark, needed this one too. Oh, my, I feel like I just got a Maybe I didn't. Okay. No LTC yet. Ooh. Okay. Riders of the Mark. I'm getting ahead of myself here. Dawn of a New Age. This one, I love the artwork on. Anato Fanstark did this uh, playmat as well. And this is in Surge Foil. Super epic. And that's a mythic card as well. So super nice. Okay. Call Forth the Tempest. In search foil, Elvish Harbinger. This is the one I have the most of, I think. 
um, silver foil from the Hildebrandt Brothers, that is. Okay, our final pack. Oh, collective sigh here because, wow. Wow. Come on, be something good. We haven't hit any Nazgul yet. Um, even if this only had a Nazgul and nothing else of great importance, I wouldn't, I wouldn't be upset at all. I hate it when it opens like that and wants to catch the corners. Okay. I mean, you never know what it's, what's going to be in these, uh, packs, so I always want to be careful. Soothing of Smeagol, Improvised Club, Shortcut to Mushrooms, Frodo Baggins, Mirkwood Spider, Second Breakfast, Intish Restoration in Silver Foil. This is a pretty decently priced card for an uncommon, at least. Click Beam, Upstart Ent, Another Island. Summons of Saruman. Nice. I think I have this card already, but I could be mistaken. Amaru, Marshal of Rohan. Galadrim Brigade. Rangers of Athelion. Rivendell. Myriad Landscape. Food token and orc army. Um, no Nazgul, this box, but we got some pretty awesome stuff in this box, nonetheless. Uh, like, like, let's just, let's just take a moment here and admire this that we found today. Like, would you be upset or disappointed with this box? I mean, two Strider Aragorn related cards, King of Gondor, two One Rings. I mean, if if we really want to get specific, three Aragorn related cards. I mean, I mean, wow. I think that's who that's supposed to be at his coronation, at least. Watch me be wrong about that. That'd be awkward. But anyway, there we are. <laughs> Holy cow. Wow.